you everyone now i'm all dressed up because i'm getting ready to go to revival so i'm excited because tonight is women's night at my church but i just wanted to make this video before i headed out and the word that the lord gave me around the midnight hour he said you must believe before you see it you must believe before you see it and bless are those who believe what the lord has spoken to them will come to pass now i know you're probably in an impossible situation well god he specializes in impossibilities and the possibility of your situation is the starting point for your miracle now the enemy will try to throw everything at you try to distract you try to make you quit try to make you throw in the towel well don't give up stand um steadfast and just believe that word that the lord has spoken over you amen because it's going to come to pass it's going to come to pass and god has not forgotten about you now the scripture today is coming from psalms 2 verse 11 it says serve the lord with fear and rejoice with trembling now many times people backslide um they give up on God because they don't fear God. They don't have no fear for the Lord in their heart. They lost that fear. Now, I'm not saying be scared of God. You know, sinners should be scared of God. But if you're living for God, what I'm saying is be in awe of God. Reverence God. That's what I mean by fear. The good kind of fear. Amen. So when you fear, when you have that healthy fear of God, then you won't sin against him because you value him. You stand on his word and you care more about pleasing God than the people of the world. All right. So serve God with fear. Remember, get that fear, that healthy fear for God, that, rev that reverence back for God in your heart. If you lost it, just pray. Say, Father, I want to get that fear back in my heart for you in jesus name amen and remember the thing that god has spoken over you it will come to pass god bless you and i love you with the love of the lord god bless